Hello everyone, in today's video we will fix the Nintendo Switch 2 not connecting to a 5 GHz Wi-Fi network. Our network settings and band fix. So the step 1 is to be simple, adjust router channel and bandwidth. So access the router settings via its IP address and check the router manual or label and set the 5 GHz bands to a lower channel and ensure the bandwidth is 80 MHz or below. As the switch 2 does not support 160 MHz or channel above 150, so save channel and restart the router and retry connection to a 5 GHz network. Okay, to do, you can simply go to the settings, internet settings and again tap on internet setting. Now firstly you can try to connect with your Wi-Fi network and then you will find its channel name. Okay, then tap on it and click on change settings. And now here you can manually enter the settings for it. Okay, and also set its proximity sensors. The settings, sorry. The next step is to you can simply split 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz SSID. If the router use a combined SSID for both, so disable this feature in the router settings and create separate SSID for 5 GHz channel. On the switch to go to the system settings and internet settings and forget the 2.4 GHz network and connect only 5 GHz SSID. So to do, tap on internet settings. Now you will see this one is my 5 GHz band. If this one is my 2.4 GHz band, then after you can simple tap on internet settings and now simple delete this network and connect with a 5 GHz channel. Tap on clear settings. The next step is to can simple ensure the security protocols are disabled in IPv4. So ensure your router 5 GHz security is set to WPA2 and WPA3 as the switch 2 does not support WEP or WPA in the router setting this one disable our IPv4 if enabled as it can cause connection issues so here you can simply reboot the router and then switch to and then again try to connect it the next step is to perform a factory reset on the switch 2 so if the above steps fail you can simply do a system transfer or corrupted network that may cause an issue so here you can simply reset the device. So to reset, open the settings, system settings, scroll down, select data clear option, and now simple click on restore to factory settings and tap on next and again tap on next. So these are the steps that can help you to fix this issue. Goodbye.